Hello everybody and welcome back to Yankee Devil, where of course every day is a train show. My name is DJ and if you're just tuning in, where the heck you been? We've been doing like 130 of these things. Anyway, we got some brand new items that hopefully will find their way on your layout and engineer hall. Guess what I got here? What you got there? You ready? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. yeah. Line out book. Ooh. Ooh, line out volume two. Check this out here. So we just got these in for the store. All the new brand new line out items that they have for. Ooh, look at that. GG1. Blue GG1. How about that? All right. So we got all these new things here that are going to be shipped at some time later, probably next year. The stuff will be coming out here. But if there's something in here that you are looking for, like maybe a Reading and Northern Diesel. Yeah. So if there's something here that you're looking for here, well, check. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. That's big steam right yeah, there. You got to have big, big steam. steam. You got to have it. So if there's something that you are looking to order from this book, well, first of all, come in, get, get a copy. We have some of these available. But you can always go online to this website, see what you're looking for here, and then come to us, tell us what you're looking for, and we'll get this uh, order for you. So when it comes in, you'll have hours of O scale fun. Speaking of a different scale here, let's go to end scale. You ready? Ready. Hopper cars. What is that? Sorry. Hopper cars. I'm gonna hop it again. Sorry. Hopper cars. There you go. Here you are. I have a three pack of Peabody Cole hopper cars here. These are offset side hopper cars here. These are really neat looking cars here. And if you're looking for a three for one deal, this is pretty good. Now, the retail value of these cars is, let's get the right page, $68.98. But you know what? We can do better than that. You can that. do way better than that. About $39.99. That's way better. Ooh, so these are really cool cars here. So if you're looking to get some offset covered hopper, or rather offset hoppers, come get these from Blueford Shops. These are really cool. I think you'll like them. So you know what, Engineer Hall, during the summer, a lot of people like to do uh, see like the latest and greatest new big summer blockbuster, right? Right, yeah. Okay, well, you know what we did here at Yankee Dabbler? What did we do? We actually financed a whole bunch of train-related movies that are coming out this summer that you can check out. And we're just doing this for you guys. We want to give you entertainment in any way we can. So you want to hear about the first one? That I want to hear out? it. All right, so you know Thomas the Tank Engine 2, right? Right. Well, we're coming out with a new one called Thomas the Tank Engine Goes to the DMV. Ooh, explain that one. All right, so in this movie, what happens is Thomas, uh, you know, was out partying the other night. <laughs> and so what ended up happening was he got his license taken away, and he has to go back to the DMV to retake his driving test so he can go back on the island of Soda, right? So it's it's a great, it's a wonderful film. Uh, the voice of Thomas is Chris Rock. So, yeah. It, Ooh, it's, that'd be interesting. It's going to yeah, be a great yeah, movie. Yeah. So stay tuned for Thomas and the Magic DMV. How oh, I'm asking you a question. So how yeah. many times he had the, uh, how many times it happened before he had to go back to the DMV? Well, I mean, you know, you have to see the prequel, which was Thomas goes to jail for uh, drunk driving. Uh -huh. uh, but you don't need to see that one in order for this one to make sense. All right. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Hey, speaking of which, we got some new cars here that hopefully will find your way. We got more colorful box cars, Engineer Hall. You know you love color. Check them out. We love our colors here. So we have here these 40-foot um, welded modern box cars here. I have the Erie. I have the DNM. Ooh, the Atlantic Coastline and the Rock Island. Look at the nice detailing on these cars here. You get all the various different writings there. Nice roof detailing happening here. I got this, so many different variations of brown. So you get a brown, more brown on your layout. But you know what, Engineer Hall, the cool thing about this is the price. So you know uh, what this thing retails for? No, you tell me. Thirty-one dollars and ninety-eight cents. What do you think we're selling here, Yankee Dabbler, for? Mm, Twenty-one ninety-nine. <laughs> Keep sliding. Keep sliding. Keep sliding. Oof. All right. Uh, let's go fourteen ninety-nine. <laughs> Way wrong. Thirteen ninety-nine. $13.99? I'm selling this car for $13.99. Oh, it, wow. And it's friends, too. Each, of course. But I defy you to go somewhere else that you're going to find a Walther's car for $13.99. Go ahead. I'll wait. I best might call in a few moments. You never know. They're probably looking at their computer right now. They're probably trying to type in Walther's cheaper. They're, probably, they're not finding it. Oh, check the comments. You see anything in the comments? Christian, 
time he shut his mouth closed. That was a fun week. Yeah. All right, so anyway, I bet you you didn't find anything, right? Yes, because we here at Yankee Dabbler, $13.99 for these uh, 40 foot modern welded box cars. So I don't know what you're waiting for. Come to Yankee Dabbler and get these cars on your layout today. You want to know about our next movie that we have coming out? Talk to me. So we financed the movie. You remember the movie The Ring where you had to like play a tape and then if you like, you know, didn't do something, you died within a certain amount of days. Oh, yeah, the girl to come out the well. Yeah, with the guess what? We did a new one called the track so you're gonna get like something in the mail probably like a dvd if anyone still has those things you put it in and you play it and if you don't buy a model train within seven days you die oh, that's cool i know so stay tuned for that one that one's coming out in uh january or, i'm sorry january july 32nd that one's coming out and uh you know who stars in that one who vin diesel what yeah, that not that Vin Diesel. We Which found one? a guy named Vincent, and he was next to a diesel. So, that's the guy we got. Well, it longs in the budget, yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. So, stay tuned for the track coming out soon. Hey, these cars are on the track. I think you're really going to enjoy these. These are 59-foot cylindrical hoppers from Walther's. Check these out here. I have here CP Rail. That's a cool one here. I'm not even going to pronounce that one. I got the Honeymead. I got the... That one, <laughs> the Burlington Northern Santa Fe, and the Noodle Canadian National. These are really neat looking cars here. I think you should buy the ones that I can't pronounce here. But check out the nice detail on these cars here. We've had various uh, versions of these cars before. This is the latest wave that they have here. Look at the nice detailing there. I love the walkways up here. And these are also going for a really nice look price, too. Engineer Hall, what do you think these things go for? Oh, uh, you got me the last time. Yep. Um, nice looking car from Walters. Mm -hmm. um, very value. I'm going to say $26. $26.99. Very close, Engineer Hall. So the retail value of this car is $34.98. We're selling it here at Yankee Dabber for $24.49. Uh, it's a good deal to get, especially if you want a whole bunch of hoppers. I think you should get a whole bunch of hoppers, a whole bunch of boxcars, and just, you know, get rid of the wife and kids and just have that rolling in your house. That's a good idea, right? Uh, we'll talk about so, that. So, come into Yankee Dabber and get these nice car hopper cars here today because everyone loves a hopper. Coming to theaters soon, our next video, just when you thought it was safe to go back into the rail yard, it's... Jaws Train Edition. Jaws? Mm hmm. Explain this one. All right, so, like, you know how, like, people used to go in the ocean, the shark with you? Mm hmm. Well, maybe some people go to the rail yard and then a train gets them. No. But, it's... of course, they start hearing this sound. Choo, 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 and then snatches. It's a great movie, right? Is it is it haunted or just you know? Well, you'll have to wait and see in Jaws Train Edition. Ooh. Come in August fifteenth and a half. All right, you have to wait for half of that day. Okay? I'll be waiting for it. Yeah, it's gonna be great. All right, so you know, Engineer Hall, I'm wearing a specific shirt here today. Oh, uh, you are? Yeah. Why? Well, I thought since we did a Pennsylvania show a little while ago, we could do another theme show, but this time we would take a look at all of our engines from Conrail. So we got camera? Yep, it's the all Dakman show. Check this one out here. We have a whole bunch of Conrails in HO and N scale that you might have overlooked the first time. Let's check them out here, shall we? Alright, so I have here a whole bunch of different diesel locomotives here. So I'm going to go through each one here. So this is a U28C. Really neat looking diesel locomotive. You might have overlooked the first time. Now, Engineer Hall, who do you think makes this one? Oh, that could be a scale train. I believe that is a scale train here, and that is of course, a, that's a GP30. Now I have an SD40 from, where do you think this is from, Engineer Hall? Uh, Broadway Limited. You got it, all right. And that's a really nice looking engine here. Now I have here an RS11. Who do you think makes this one? Uh, this is a very good looking RS11. Um, I want to say Bowser, but not Repito. Repito, that is great. All right, and then my personal favorite out of the group, I don't know why, this is that GP7 here. Who makes that one, Engineer Hall? GP7, uh, look like a, um, Athen? That is an Athen, and you know what I really like about this one is if you zoom in a little bit here, you can see the control panels and whatnot. That was a really cool looking engine. And then, don't worry, N-Scalers, I got you covered back here. So I have here a Scale Trains 
uh, locomotive here. This is a C39-8. Really cool looking engine there. And then I got two Atlas engines here. I have here an SD9 and then a dash eight dash 40. If you take a look at that one on the front there, it actually says something. I can't really read what it says because I'm getting older, but it says here, the labor management. So that is really cool. Like little logo happening here on this locomotive here. If we could get it to zoom in. It's a really cool looking engine here. Now, like Conrail, it's kind of a, a railroad that has a little bit of controversy because you got the old school guys that don't like Conrail, and then you have the newer people that really like it, especially for me when I was a kid. I remember seeing these blue engines all the time. So I absolutely love the look of Conrail blue. So if you're a Conrail guy, here you go. But even if you're not a Conrail guy, I think you should take a look at some of these engines here because there's a really a lot of really cool uh, looks here. There's a lot of history. You can say that some of these engines here were bought out from a previous railroad and repainted to be on the Conrail route or whatnot. This is a lot of really neat stuff here, and you got a lot of history. For example, if you take a look here at GP7, where's my can opener? There's no can opener in there. EH. So there's just a lot of really cool things happening with these engines here. And just like we did with the Pennsylvania show, we're going to run them engine here. Also, let's get going. We're going to fire up Big Blue. Let's go.
That's a lot of blue, isn't it, Engineer Hall? A sea of blue. Oh, yes. Now, you're probably wondering how much these inches cost. So I'm going to tell you what they are. You ready? So if you're interested in the HO, I'm going to do the HO first. The U28C, we're selling here at Yankee Dabbler for $209.95. The GP30, that one sells for $299.99. That's the scale trains. The SD40, which is a Broadway Limited, we're selling here at Yankee Dabbler for $220. For the GP7, which is an after, and that one was $255.99. And for the RS11, which was a repeater, that's $279.99. So all these engines are under $300, engine there, Hall. There you go. Pretty good. And that trend's going to continue with N scale. So for the scale train C39 A, we're selling that here at Yankee Dabbler for $254.99. And for the dash 8, uh, the Atlas, uh, we're selling that one for $174.99. And the SD9, we're selling that for $179.99. So a lot of great deals to get on some awesome looking engines so if you're a conrail fan a railroad fan or just like the color blue come to yankee dabbler and get all those engines running on your layout you know i have kind of an idea i was thinking of engineer hall would you like to entertain me let's do it what you okay. got for me let's go so uh this is your bright idea you like it so i got them all on i got eight engines you know what that means eight different horns but wait, 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 wait. before you do that what? You can't uh, look. You get your bright idea. Right. Here goes your bright idea. Go Am ahead, I man. Part of the Conrail family now. There you go. Woohoo! Yeah. Oh man, great. Conrail time. Let's go. Eight horns. <laughs> Eight bells. You would think this would be annoying, but it's not. I could do this all day. I just might. Hey, would you quit it? No more. It's fun. No. No more. <laughs> Are you ready for the final uh, movie that we have coming at Engineer Hall? Talk to me. What well, we you got? know, Unstoppable was a really popular movie, right? True. Well, guess what? We have Unstoppable 2 coming out. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's right. We couldn't afford Chris Pine or Denzel Washington, but don't worry, we got the next best thing. Are you we ready? Got, oh. We got Alfonso Ribeiro okay. and Tom Arnold. Wait a minute. The guy from Fresh Pinch and the guy that met Roseanne? Yeah. I mean, what? look, we got to work with the budget that we have, but I think it's going to be a great movie. Also, the engine may be one of those little type, type of things that you ride on, but it's going to be a great movie, so stay tuned for that. August 37th is coming out here, so you really got to enjoy that. I'm looking forward to that. Yep, that's on Disney Super Plus. All right, so check that one out. Hey, speaking of Super, let's take a look at some things that we saw here on today's show here. From Walther's, we had the Cylindrical Hoppers. We also had these Modern Boxcars. Ooh, and Scale Time, we had these three-pack of Hopper cars here. And then we had a whole bunch of different things on our Conrail show. We have here N-Scale and HO diesel locomotives from various different manufacturers. A lot of different awesome Conrail action happening here. So it's a really good show that we had here. So if you're a Conrail fan, I hope you are. I Wait, hope you enjoy hold, what we saw. hold on. Yeah. I think I forgot somebody. What, what? What's this? Okay, so a lot of us might remember this has been in the background of our show for a while now. So this is actually a Conrail safety set that was given out by K-Line, which is a fun company. I think this was like in 2001 this guy came out here. But this is a model of the executive train that they had here. And guess what? I actually got this from a former Conrail employee. And we have this available at our stores, not on our website. But if this is something that interests you, I have this set as well as the two add-on cars that went with it. So if you're interested, come to Yankee Dabbler in our store in Belmar, New Jersey. Give us a call here. We're selling it for 480 for the entire set. That's two engines and I believe seven cars here. So it's a great deal to get on a really cool, fun-looking O-scale set. Especially if you're a Conrail fan, I think you need it. 
Hey, speaking of things you need, if you're looking for more stuff to get, go on our website, yankeedabbler.com, type in the search bar what you're looking for so we can get it to you, ship it to you, and you have a lifetime of rare running fun. Doesn't that sound great, Engineer Hall? A lifetime says, lifetime. sounds so amazing. Oh my gosh, it's so great here. All right, and speaking of Engineer Hall, if you're not clicked on the Engineer Hall's channel, to subscribe, get the bell for the notifications, all that stuff. You'll get hours of railroading fun. I mean, what other show out there just blows eight horns and bells for hours on end? Let me let me think. Uh, okay. The answer is none, right? Yeah, you're right. Nobody's this stupid. I mean, amazing enough to do this type of stuff. So click and make sure you get caught up on all of our videos that we have.